Right, it is Thursday today. This is what I've decided to start on today because that is in a half there. I want to start getting this door to open and shut properly like the other one. At the moment when you open it, it drops. Obviously because of that strength has gone. So I'm going to start repairing that. This is my next job. I will get back onto the passenger side. It's just my main concern at the moment is to get the strength back into her. So that's what I'm going to make a start on. And I'll uh, bring you back. Um, because I've got a lot of work on this side. I'm going to make a start and then I'll feel much better. I shall be stronger. So I've got to remove this. And work. this is all rotten, see, it all moves. So when I open this, obviously this flexes and drops the door down. At the moment I've got the door shut properly onto its hinge because I want to keep this straight while I'm working on that. As soon as I get it clamped in, I will open the door and I'll weld it because obviously I don't want to burn any of this because I still haven't took that off yet. That yeah, back shortly. That's where I am so far. Look at the state of that. I've got to cut this bit out of there. Because all up here is rotten. Everything's rotten. That is a jacking point, I believe, which I'm never going to use. So all in there is rotten. I need to take that bracket off there because I think that's for a cable to go through. So. I'll keep an old of this front bit because I've got to really make a new shape of this. All the way around this, I'm going to have to take this bracket off. But that's what I'm doing so far. So, I'll get back to you when I've done some more. But I've got my work cut out on this one. I've got to keep measurements. This is where I'm working now. I just want to get some strength back into it. Back shortly. This is where I've got to so far. I've removed, so I've got the lip there. That's what I'm going to work, go by. All of this here, <clears throat> all of it flexes. <laughs> There's only that little strand right on the end here holding this together. So I've got to be extremely careful. So I am so far. I'm also removing this because it's all rotten behind there. So that's it so far. Ooh, getting scary. All that down there is off the off the silt. I'm enjoying this. This will be the last bit to do to keep the car strong. This is the only weakness in this car now. I mean, before I put the outer sills on, I will put all the doors back on, obviously, so I can line up the doors with the outer sills. So, that won't be done until I put the doors back on. Um, so, yep, yeah, that's what I'm at at the minute. All of that, I've got all that arch to repair in there. All the way up to there. So, I'll bring you back when I've started doing more. So far, this is still in place, it's not moved. So that's what I've got so far. I've left the outer sill bits that's remaining in place so it doesn't move. So <clears throat> that's what I've done so far. All of that in there, right to there, all the way up to there, in the bull arch. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll bring you back when I've started doing more. It's one last look.
at this horrible mess. I'll be back with you soon. Look, back shortly. That's what it looks like at the moment. Back shortly. It's a big old oil repair there. I've got to repair all the way up there. I'm going to start with this section because I've got to make all of this. All of this. It's Obviously, it's got some light rust on it at the minute. Because I've cut this again because this was only to hold it in place, keep the strength. Yeah, that's it. I've got to check all this out. That seems alright. Uh, yeah. Short run. it so far. I've cut all of that out. All up there's been cut out. It's having a new piece put on that's going to be welded to the lip here, spot welded. And then I've got to put the piece in. I've got to create this piece and put that piece back, and then the flooring goes round here. So that's it so far. So, in a way, I'm repairing inside the well arch at the same time. I'll be back when I've done some more. I haven't been doing much. I've only just managed to get back out again because I've been ill. Bunged up with a cold. So, back shortly. Hi everyone. Well, it says um, Wednesday today. As you can tell, I've got very well. Right, this is what I've been doing. That corner, I had to rebuild. And I'm telling you now, I will do not want to ever have to do that again. This shape here was very tricky. I had to do measurements from here up, matching that side. Measurements, flip it, oh, there's measurements galore. I even had to measure from this hole to there. Like I had to get this bracket back in place. So, I've just got a day drill, all the spot welds up there. I've had to shape all of this. I couldn't build this into one sheet because it was too many tricky corners. So unfortunately I've had to make this section separate. But then I'll build from here up to the front. But this bit, I could not build this into the one sheet. It would have been way too hard to get all of this corner here built. There's tricky shapes all over the place. That's my uh, homemade seal. I'm not showing you the rest of that yet because I don't want people hating on me. I'm only filming now when I've started to complete something. So I'll be back with you when I've cleaned all this up a bit more, put in the spot boards, grinded them flat. And then, I'm not even going to prove myself. The welds are coming out from the other side. I'm not even going into any of that. I'm fed up with all the people insulting me. It is what it is. I know it's safe, and that's all that matters. If haters are not driving the car, I am. So, I'll get back to you when I've done some more. Right, this is it, all that's in. It's got a finish bit some spot holes down the side of there. That's my seal I made. That's all back in. All up there is repaired. As it should be. All in there is repaired and welded. 
stronger than it's meant to be because I've seen molded it all the way around there as well as inside the arch. At the moment I've put some etch prime on there to stop my metal rusting. All around there seam sealed because obviously don't know what getting in through there. I've even pushed some seam seal down into there. Door shuts. That will obviously go in and just over sills put on. I never ever want to have to make a corner like that again. Ever. All this is replaced. From there on, the foot that will go now go to the front. We've made that bit there. Looks like that bit there. Uh, all this corner's done. That, I'm not going to lie, that was a lot of hard work, that was. I had to go in the world tub to shape it as well. At the moment it's in etch primer. All that's back in. I've lined, I've pulled the seat down and it lines up with the bolt hole. Right there along with the one on the other side because I have to take measurements from that one for that one I have to like find measurement like from that bottle to there that bottle to line up vice versa from like here to there all to get them in the correct place so tomorrow when I come out I'm going to grind these back because obviously I haven't had time tonight still loads more for me to do Hopefully this is a nice long video for you, as I've not uploaded for seven days. So, really hope you like what I've done. I've even cleaned the window. <laughs> My beautiful focus. That is my pride and joy, that is. So, yeah. I've even made the hole for the cable to come through. Again, measured from the one on the passenger side. It's about just under a three inch hole or something like that. But a grommet will go in there anyway. That's why it's got to be replaced. Got to finish shaping that indent. But I'm going to do that when the floor's in because obviously this will be nice and strong then. I'll show you a little sneak peek to the front. It's all lined in there. I've they ignore that, they were just quick weld sold it in place. There's no hole there now. If I grab this, the whole car shakes, it's solid. And the door opens and shuts now. So please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully it won't take me as long this time. I'm still getting over a cold. I haven't been feeling very well. I've been feeling dizzy. So I've been fighting to do this. Obviously because it's my priority. My pride and joy. But I'm really chuffed with that. Half of the, half of the wheel arch has actually been rebuilt on the inside. And as you all know the back end of the car is all good in the boot so I'm getting very close to actually having a strong car now before you know it I'll be putting the carpet and everything back in I'm going to try and save my carpet the blue one see you soon bye bye